you ever wondered how VTubers track their hands when they are filming? Some VTubers are stagnant, but now hand tracking is more prevalent in the VTubing community than ever. There are many ways to go about it, and I'm going to show you the easiest way, which is using Hyper Online. VRM and imported avatars are coming soon to the platform. First, get Hyper Online for desktop. You'll have to make sure that your character is properly rigged. If you need help, we have a guide on best practices to getting your imported avatar working with Hyper. Hyper also has a mobile application where you can use your VTuber for streaming or making videos, equipping emotes and poses and more. This makes it super easy to record skits that require different camera angles. However, if you want to use the hand tracking function, head over to the desktop application. The app is currently in beta, but by the time you see this, it might be out. If it isn't, you can check our social media profiles for invite codes, our Discord, or you can get invites from other users. To use the hand tracking, make sure that you're in a well-lit environment and you're wearing clothing that doesn't have busy patterns or conflicting colors with your background. Create your character in the Customize section. In the future, you will be able to import your characters to use with hand tracking. There are so many different options to choose from, so make sure you make one that suits you. You'll also need a webcam. The one that comes with your device should work. Turn on your camera and make sure to allow Hyper if this is your first time using it. You might have to go into your settings if you're on a Mac and allow Hyper from there as well. And after you do all this, restart your application. After, go to the webcam and OBS area with this icon and enable hand tracking. And with that, hand tracking is enabled. If you lift up your hands, wiggle them around, your character should track. If your character doesn't, toggle the icon on and off. It's as simple as that. You can port Hyper over to use with OBS, so you can use it with streaming, or you can use Hyper for Zoom meetings and much more. Follow along for more tutorials and join our Discord if you want to meet other VTubers. Bye!